Pop squat. Come on at you. We're going to do a song from Beulie and Julian and Amour uh, called Only Time Will Tell. And it uh, looks like this came out about a month ago. It is hashtag ambient. We'll see how true that is. Um, I don't know anything about Amour. Uh, Bulian, or Bulian Julian, as I have heard him refer to in the past, as he has sent me music, music and tracks. Um, oh, I have... Oh, no. Okay, so Amour must also be associated with uh, Laredo and Bulian Julian. So I have listened to this track, I think, here, Free SRT, or we did something with this cover artwork. Maybe that was the track. Um, but let's check this out. Uh, this is uh, another one that Julian sent in to me and said, hey, you should check this out by somebody I really like. Apparently that's a more and him. So he's getting some own, his own uh, promotion in here as well. Um, let's check it out. Two minutes, 54 seconds. Came out a month ago. Only time will tell from Bulian or Bulian Julian and a more. <laughs> Love it. Only time will tell at this point. Dedicated. Only time will tell at this point. You know I'm dedicated. Yeah, yeah. I'm dedicated. Yeah, yeah. I'm motivated. Motivated. So I'm really liking the sound of this, and I gotta admit that beginning where it sort of uses the whoever's singing their voice or the sample, I'm not sure which is which it is, uh, but it cuts it off. So it's sort of like you're beginning to hear a word and then it cuts it off, and instead it turns it into sort of this weirdly oblongly uh, blunted note that you think is going to continue and then all of a sudden it just ends and it, it just becomes this kind of stunted sort of word uh, and, and I really like the effect that it has because it gives the the track a, a really distinctive sound and I think it sounds very very cool and I would like to hear more of this sort of thing where you think it's going to be a full word a full lyric of something and instead it just goes ah, thump, and cuts off it's very very cool in fact, some of that might even be played in reverse. Love the way he's performing those lyrics. Absolutely love them. I'm not sure if that was the best break I've seen in a track recently. Uh, I kind of drop everything away here, and, and it's, I mean, my opinion, right? doesn't mean they have to change anything but uh, it drops away and I really like the balance in the beginning section of this song that we were just listening to 
the balance between the lyrics and the music because it seems like each of them have equal weight and I think that's absolutely appropriate for the feel of this song. Well, I haven't heard it any other way. Um, but it sounds very cool and then when this they create this break in the middle everything sort of drops out and you can see it in the in the sort of the, the levels of the music up here just after where the orange stops there um, it drops away and I don't think it's extreme enough I'd almost like to see more drop out so uh, and maybe for a shorter period of time I don't know uh, but I don't think this break does exactly what we need it to do in the song which is to break us of the sort of cool smooth hypnotic feel of the first part of the song and give us a little bit of a break from that and maybe clue us in a little bit more give us a little like funky coolness to to clamp onto with our ears and then listen again and re-engage with that smooth coolness of the track as we get into the second part which i assume is mostly going to sound like that first half so how i like the smell of your cologne though I tell her I think I'm in a half alone, uh, they try to steal my flow, uh, I know this gon' hit me when I'm like, uh, only time I'll tell at this point, I'm dedicated, only time I'll tell at this point. Yeah, it seems like they they ramped up almost a little too quickly back into the lyrics and that kind of smooth feeling of it. I would have liked something just a little more jarring, a little more differentiated from what's going on around it. It's my opinion, right? That's what I would have liked. Because that's really not detracting from the song, because I think this is a really super pleasant, very peaceful, smooth track that I'm really enjoying. Sounds like whales. Yeah, I really like it. It's uh, it's a good makeout song. Uh, I don't know what the lyrics are exactly. I, I wish I had them in front of me, but I don't. Uh, it's a it's a good sounded song. I uh, totally love it. Thanks for sending this in, Julian, and I uh, can't wait to hear more from you. Seriously, send me more music. Love it. Pop squat. <laughs> Checking out. Please like, subscribe, and share. Bye-bye.